Hello everyone, this is Kalpana here. In this video, we are going to solve a differential equation using solvable copy method. So, let's get started. Problem, solve p minus 1 by p equals to x by y minus y by x. Solution, given differential equation, P minus 1 by P equals to X by Y minus Y by X. Then P into P, P square minus 1 by P equals to X by Y minus Y by X. So you can write this as P square minus 1 equals to X by Y minus Y by X times P. Then P square minus X minus O. Simply we are taking this term to LHS. X by Y minus Y by X into P equals to 0. So now we can rewrite it as P square minus X by Y minus Y by X into P minus 1 equals to 0. Okay. So, you are having x by y into y by x. The product of x by y and y by x will be 1, right? So, now we can replace this 1 by x by y into y by x so that the next step we can take common. Okay, we will see. Then, p square minus, minus of x by y minus y by x into p minus x by y into y by x equals to 0. Then p square minus x by y into p minus into minus plus y by x into p minus x by y into y by x equals to 0. Okay. Now take p common from the first two terms. So, you get P times P minus X by Y. And you are having Y by X in both the two terms, right? There is in the next two terms. So, we can take Y by X common from the next two terms. You get Y by X times P minus X by Y. Okay? So, you are having P minus X by Y in both the terms. So, take P minus X by Y common from these two terms. Then, P minus X by Y into P plus Y by X equals to 0. Then, P minus X by Y equals to 0 and P plus Y by X equals to 0. So, we will find solutions for these two. So, firstly, let's find solution for P minus X by Y equals to 0. You can write it as P equals to X by Y. Now, put P equals to dy by dx. Then, you will get dy by dx equals to x by y then y into dy equals to x into dx here the variables are separable so we can integrate on both sides integral y dy equals to integral x dx then Integral y dy is y squared by 2 equals to integral x dx is x squared by 2 plus integral constant c. Then y squared by 2 equals to x squared plus 2c by 2. Simply by taking LCM of 2 and 1 you get 2. In the numerator you get x squared plus 2 times c by c. Okay. Now cancel. 2 in the denominator, you get y square equals to 
x square plus 2c. You can write 2c as c since c is constant. Then y square minus x square minus c equals to 0 is solution for p minus x by y equals to 0. This one. Okay. Now consider the second one, p plus y by x equals to 0, then p equals to y by x, put p equals to dy by dx, then dy by dx, you get minus here, right, equals to minus y by x, then 1 by y dy equals to minus 1 by x into dx, since variables are separable, can integrate on both sides. Integral 1 by y dy equals to minus of integral 1 by x dx. Integral 1 by y dy is log of y equals to minus. Integral 1 by x dx is log of x. Since we are having both terms in log, so we will take constant as log of c. So you can take this minus log x to LHS or you can write it as it is, okay. So this equals to log c minus log x. Since log c, you know that log a minus log b equals to log a by b. Then this becomes log y equals to log c by x. Okay? If log a equals to log b, then a equals to b. Then this becomes y equals to c by x, then x y equals to c, from this we get x y minus c equals to 0, which is solution for p, p plus y by x equals to 0. Okay? So the combined form of these two solutions will be the required solution for the given differential equation. Therefore, y square minus x square minus c into x y minus c equals to 0 is the required solution. So this completes the problem. So we have seen a problem from solvable for p in this video. Hope you will understand. We will see you in the next video. Until then, bye bye.